a long time in Kenya, but uh, I'll be happy to come back some some day and spend more time in Nairobi and uh, get to know more of the unique culture here. So it's very impressive. You know, we use um, we recycle clothes when people throw their stuff away. We take it, he takes it, and he flips it into something amazing. Yeah, so it's. I, I know Africa, but uh, this. Uh, this setup here with so it's many unique. people yeah creating content uh, for for youtube or whatever they they stream it uh it's very impressive and very interesting so my fashion is all about expressing yourself in every way you can right so i'm inspired by a lot of devilish stuff right yeah <laughs> yeah and so <laughs> yeah hello Hey, how are you? Good. What about you? I'm okay. I'm okay. Hello. Yo. Your name, please? Kenyan Ro. Kenyan Ro, maybe, yeah. yeah. Hello, hello. My name is Alfred. Alfred Aura. Aura. And the tourist himself? My name is Ilya. I'm coming from Bulgaria, from Sofia. Welcome to Nairobi, Karibu, Kenya. Yes. So, what is the beauty behind your fashion? Oh, so my name is Austin Ochichi. I'm an actor, okay? Yes. And so I work with Kenyan Row, he's my designer, right? So my fashion is all about expressing yourself in every way you can, right? So I'm inspired by a lot of devilish stuff, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and so. <laughs> yeah, so this. Yeah, a lot of devilish stuff, right? And I feel like it's exciting to try something scary a little bit, you know, just to throw them off a little bit. But, you know, God is good. <laughs> nice. At least we have had God is good. Tell us something behind your fashion, please. Yo, this is Kenyan Road, the best designer in 254. You know, uh, I'm the king of the street, so I'm just in the street to see how people is dressed, yeah? My name is Aura, as I told you. You can find me at Instagram at Alfie underscore Aura underscore model. Uh, I'm a model, I'm a dancer, and I'm also a stylist. Uh, Kenyan Roy is my designer. I appreciate the work he does, and we are, we, we are bringing we are bringing more on the streets. You know, we want to 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 to, to change this. We want to change from ordinary to extraordinary. We're breaking boundaries. That's what's up. Great. I appreciate that. Like I'm Mariel Madid. I'm fashion model. I'm actually came from Paris. Yeah. Great. Is it expensive to dress like this? Um. It's it's expensive what we're wearing right now, but if you want to be a part of this, we can work with your budget. He can work with your budget, whatever amount you give him, he makes it. Because, you know, we use, um, we recycle clothes when people throw their stuff away. We take it, he takes it, and he flips it into something amazing. Yeah, so it's pretty much exciting, actually. All right. Yeah. If someone wants to reach you guys... How can they reach you? So the whole thing is Kenyan Row. Yes. But if you are, if you like me, I don't know. Austin Uchichi, the actor. Yeah. Austin Uchichi. Yeah, that's it. All right. I'd like to talk to one model. Huh? You can just come. Huh? If someone wants to hire you to be a model for some clothes, how much should the person be prepared with? Oh, good. Like, uh, the thing is, like, uh, it depends with the company you are going to work with. The brands, huh? Yes. It depends with the brand you are going to work with. Like, uh, if, if, it, it, if it is a big brand, I can work with him according how he is, because he's a big brand. But if it is a small brand, I can work with the brand according how he is. On a budget. Yeah. I've seen you are very much excited about the fashion in Nairobi. Yeah, I know, very excited. My first afternoon here, I don't know why, it's because it's Sunday afternoon, yes. but everyone is very, very trendy in this part of town, very trendy. And I don't know where those guys went, but they are very, very, uh, very, very impressive. What, what was his name? I mean, I have... Ken, the Kenyan Row. Kenyan Row. Yes. No, yes, so very, very exciting part of town. Uh, and uh, I mean, you guys are so creative. I can see a lot of people here showing the best of them yes and uh yeah i mean i'm really really happy really really excited to be here i mean i'm only here this afternoon yes uh but uh yeah very nice maybe you can introduce yourself again uh, i'm from B sofia which is in bulgaria which is in europe and we're coming here to go to a little safari in uh -huh. kenya rwanda uganda and burundi and tanzania so travel around victoria lake uh -huh. 
uh, and we'll have some fun. There's 10 of us, but the rest are sleeping in the hotel. <laughs> Very boring people. Uh, and uh, yeah, but uh, so I was having just a stroll this afternoon here and I just find myself in this part of town and it's very, very impressive. Very interesting, very lively, a lot of creativity going on around here. There was some dancing over there. Yeah, I saw you took taking people. some photos. Yes, I mean, it's, just, it's very authentic. People really show their Kenyan side. So, yeah, no, very, very, very nice. So, is today your first? day in Nairobi or you have been around? No, no, my, my first afternoon and we, we arrived very early this morning. Oh, So nice. we, we, yeah, we arrived very early in this morning, had a few hours sleep in the hotel, had lunch and then uh, I just found myself here um, and it's very impressive, very nice. Great. So what was your first impression when you came to Kenya? Uh, very colorful, very colorful and very young people, a lot of young people and there's university over there. Nairobi, uh, university of yeah, Nairobi. Yeah, uh, University of Nairobi, so I guess that's why there's a lot of young people. And a lot of people taking photos and doing photo sessions and video sessions and I don't know what else, but a lot of photography going on on the streets of Nairobi, a lot, a lot. So Did you I get any culture of, shock? Sorry? Did you get any culture shock? Uh, I've been in Africa many times. Oh. I've been in Af not my first time in Kenya, but I've been all around. I've been in Tanzania, uh -huh. I've been in Morocco, South Africa, Namibia, Rwanda, so not, not Rwanda, we're going to Rwanda now, Botswana, Zimbabwe, so I've been around, I've been around, yeah. I've been to Zanzibar, so I, I know Africa, but uh, this, uh, this setup here with so many people, yeah, creating content uh, for, for YouTube or whatever they, they stream it. Uh, it's very impressive and very interesting, yeah. Wow. Very, very nice. For how long will you be in Kenya? Uh, I know we're in Kenya only for a couple of days and then we're going to Uganda and then Rwanda and then I don't know what happens after that. Uh, so not not a long time in Kenya, mm -hmm. but uh, I'll be happy to come back some someday and spend more time in Nairobi and uh, get to know more of the unique culture here. So it's very impressive. Yeah. Very impressive. Huh? Very. Have you seen any similarity between Kenya and your country back home? Uh, not so much really, not so much. It's a, it's a different place. A different I mean, the young people are the same, I guess, everywhere, but it's a different place. The colors are different, the clothes are different. Uh, and I don't think we have a place in Sofia where so many people are creating stuff in one place. I mean, there's people that are creating stuff all around. But not like, a, you know, they saw people dancing over there, I can see, you can, you can film over there, people dancing. Uh, and, uh, and all happens amongst traffic and yeah. quite a lot of fumes. But that's fine. I guess this is how the life is. So The best thing you're enjoying Nairobi. All right.